You hear me good in the back? Yeah. Everybody good today? Good. So rather, rather than canceling, uh, we had a last minute addition, which is myself. My uh, CEO couldn't make it today. So I'll tell you uh, just a quick story on how I became the one to present to you today. Um, last minute, I thought to myself I needed a new pair of shoes for our uh, Miami trip. Something uh, casual, not too fancy, maybe something I can go to dinner in or maybe a club or so, something. Um, so I'm literally at the shoe store looking in the mirror at these shoes and my phone rings and it's my CEO. So I pick up the phone, he says, Vince, I can't make it. You need to present. And I says, okay, I, I did work on the investor presentation quite a bit, so I can do that. He says, no lie, put your dancing shoes on. And I said, well, funny story, I uh, actually have them on right now, so that's, uh, that's how you guys got stuck with me today. How does this go? So let's just dive right in. We are, um, again, my name is Vince Palermo. I'm the head of investor relations for Gage Cannabis. We are located in Hamilton, Ontario, for those of you who do not know where that is, about 40 minutes uh, away from Toronto. Um, so just tell you a little bit about us, our investment highlights. We have a proven management team from all over the world. We have product development, knowledge, and experience. We have an award-winning team. And when I say we have an award-winning team, I mean we, wanted to really build our team and create our story rather than spending our initial investor dollars on marketing per se. We really built that team and made sure that we had um, those people in place. With that, we do have a relationship with Canopy. Now Canopy invested in us pre-rev, pre-license. So that's a testament to the team we actually have in place. We received a $10 million investment via Canopy Rivers. We have a offtake and distribution relationship with Canopy, which entitles them to 25% of phase one production. As we grow, not just plants, but as we grow as a company and we are running uh, on full capacity with all three phases, that 25% number shrinks to about less than 2.5%. Who we are? We are, Radical is our holding company. They focus on our research and development, product formulation, tissue culture, process development, and nursery. Gage is our brand our medical and rec brand for that matter. We focus on indoor and premium craft cannabis, and we are committed to brand building and brand activation. We are on a mission to become the leader in craft cannabis. We are a premium consumer packaged good business with all of its products derived from cannabis. Quality cannabis is at the forefront of everything that we do. And this is achieved again by our people, our process, and our infrastructure. We have a strong belief and support for our corporate family. We take pride in offering sound living wages and benefits to our team. And again, we stand by quality not only for our product, but for the team. We are a small batch premium craft cannabis company. And what this means is no room is bigger than 2,000 square feet. All of our plants are in a 100% hydroponic system in an almost fully automated system, I should add. And this ensures that each plant gets the attention and you know, it's a more intimate relationship between our growers and the plants, having it in a small batch setting. Again, we're focused on top shelf flour for, for full flour pre-rolls and vape. Our extracts team has over 20 years of cannabis extraction experience, and we have exceeded industry yield averages.
edibles and outdoor. We have a joint venture in place with a company who has been partnering with some of the largest brands in Canada for the past 20 years. This venture is going to allow us to provide co-packing for small to medium producers, micro producers and processors and also non-cannabis companies who wish to add a different sales channel to their, to their company. For us, the outdoor was a real game changer. We've partnered with a group from California who currently operates on a thousand acres at one time, I will add. And th for this, it allows a company of our size, uh, a smaller company uh, in terms of um, capacity uh, in relation to other larger companies, it allows us to have biomass to feed into our other business lines. So essentially creating a, an ecosystem within our own company and not having to rely on others. The Canadian cannabis market potential, obviously October 17th was a pretty significant day in Canadian history where they legalized the use of recreational marijuana in Canada. Um, I won't spend too much time on this because cannabis is something that is a global opportunity right now. But in Canada we have a $2 billion market potential on the medical side for 2020 and on the rec side, $10 billion. And uh, we really believe that the Canadian system and what we have in place will act as a platform for the rest of the world. So just to get into our projected timelines and what we have going on right now, currently we have phase one running at 100% capacity. This gives us 3,000 kilograms of annual production. And again, that's where the offtake agreement with Canopy growth is in place. Phase two is about 60 days away, and that'll add another 3,000 kilograms annually. Phase three, we've started design, and that should be, we should start construction later on this year, and hopefully have it ready for later this year, beginning of next year. And that's where we're really gonna, really gonna increase our production to about 14,000 kilograms per year. We do, again, have outdoor production on about 80 acres in southern Ontario. This is going to give us approximately 800 to 1,000 kilograms per acre. And our edibles, beverages, and ingestible, will, we're looking at about 1 million pieces annually, and that'll come in different forms. So our team, Ziad Reda is our CEO who could not make it here today, and that's why you guys got stuck with me. Um, we have an award-winning team. Zied's background is in restricted product sales, including alcohol, tobacco, pharmaceutical, and lottery. Sorry, not pharmaceutical, and lottery. Dr. Rena Harb has 150 drug submissions through Health Canada. And Sean Karunian, who has experience launching brands all over the world and has worked with companies such as PlayStation, Warner Brothers, the NFL, and Sony, to mention a few. Our executive team, Rakesh Upadhyaya, is our Chief Quality Assurance Officer. He has over 30, over 30 years of experience in QA and QC. Vincent Villanis is our Chief Cultivation Officer. He has success growing on over 100,000 square feet. And Dr. Jordi Stewart, who is our world-renowned pharma R&D and formulation specialist, heads up our research and development. Our advisory team, Dr. Adele Ramal, Innovation and Product Development Advisor. Dr. Anthony Lombardi, Medical and Pain Advisor. Dr. Zoltan Rona, Medical Advisor. David Melanowski, Cultivation Advisor. Hilton Silberg is a pharmacist advisor, and Dr. Pratesh Kumar is a cannabinoid research scientist, pharmacologist, and laboratory manager. And our advisor chain gives us over five cannabis cup wins, consulted research experience with cannabinoid pharmacology, holistic medical expert, and best-selling author, 
And again, we have that experience with pharmaceutical operations and experience. So that comes to the end of the presentation. And I look forward to chatting with any of you who would like to chat about investment opportunities. I did mail my business cards, but they never made it to the hotel. So that's just an, one little thing from coming from Canada. But um, anybody have any questions or anything? We have uh, partnered with uh, a company for extraction, yes. That's it? Question in the back? How do you compete with the large companies? How do we compete with the large companies? For us, it's more, again, with the brand and having our core values, which are you know, having integrity, having that right team in place, and having a top, top tier flower, and not, you know, not venturing off course. Okay, so for us, it's 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 the team. We have that family dynamic in the team. Um, yeah. So, nice question. So, yeah. So it's a good question. Um, we are one of the 26 licensed producers, the initial 26 uh, chosen by OCS. W however, we just received our sales license less than two months ago. Um, so we, you won't find our product on the OCS shelf just yet. Coming soon. Do we have sales? Absolutely. So it's been, like I said, less than two months, um, and we've already had about over one and a half million in sales. Yeah. What's that? Yeah. Okay.